Hello everyone, welcome to the session. In this session, we are going to see how we can export file from Fusion UCM Content Server using UCM Web Service. In the previous session, we have seen how to import file into Fusion using UCM Web Service and in this session, we are going to download or export the same file from Fusion Cloud using UCM Web Service. Let us take the wisdom and create another project in SOAP UI tool. So create so project, let's give name UCM file export service is the wisdom and hit OK. So this is the sample SOAP message. Now we will update this with the message that we have. So let's copy this and update the SOAP body. Here as you can see the web key is CS as usual. IDC service would be get underscore file. Document name would be the UCM content ID and the revision selection method would be latest. And this is the default value for any document. So let us copy the content ID for the file that we uploaded and paste it over here. Next, we have to attach the security with this SOAP message. Next, we have to click on this project and show project view. Go to WS security configurations, click on this plus icon and give some name test config, click OK, select must understand, click on this plus icon, select username, click OK and enter the username and the password for the instance that we are using. Select password type as password text. Next, click on this plus icon again, this time select timestamp, click OK and that's it about the WS security configuration. Next, we will go to the request and we will add those security policy in our request and next add the timestamp over here. I will make 6000 milliseconds. The message is formatted. I will hit on the go button to get the file. So as we can see that we have received the response along with the attachment. Click on this attachments tab and select this to see the file. Let's open this with notepad and click OK. So this is a sample file that is the attachment or text that we have sent in our previous session. So this is how we can export file from UCM content server using UCM web service. That's it. Thank you and bye bye.